I want I want a painted sphere that has chrome underneath, paint on top, and like it's scratched up. And then when the scratches, we will be able to see the paint under. We'll be able to see the chrome underneath the paint. Grab a material, my metallic material. I'm gonna plug that into there. Boom. There's our metallic material. And I like to use the GGX model, Energy Preserve model, and it gets super right now. It's so clean and it looks fake, right? So what I want to do from here, add a little bit of roughness in there. Now I'm going to come in here, add a noise texture, and I'm going to drag this noise texture into the roughness, right? And now this is adding a whole bunch of noise that is making it look like it's not even has any uh, texture or, or any roughness on it. So what we could do, let's go ahead and add in a XY thing here. Like this is like a scratchy like scratchy like little porous type of metal right and if you want more details in that you can add a little bit more details in that i'm gonna plug this into the bump now come down here and plug that into the bump and see what that does Woo! that's huge we need to change that now this is a good example you get to see what this how this is affecting the how it affect the roughness versus how it affected the bump hold down shift and just add in a little bit of this in right and if I come back here and make this zero, you can see that bump is actually bumping to the point where it's affecting the roughness, where it actually looks like it's affecting the roughness. Free Octane Blender 101 guide. Here's how you can learn the basics of Octane Blender within 24 hours and create realistic renders at www.petroclavard.com. Sign up today.